up? I'm Hannah Eden, and I'm here to take you through your day one of your 30-day FIRE program. So let me tell you a little about myself and about this program and how we're going to get started. I'm going to guide you guys through this workout. Through the next 30 days, you are going to change your life, not just physically, but mentally as well. But before we begin, there's some things that I need to let you know. I can teach you exercises. I can teach you how your form should be, and, and I can give you a program to follow. There's one thing that I cannot teach you, and that is intensity. You guys are in total control of what you get out of this workout. What you put in is exactly what you're gonna get out. So, no matter what fitness level you're at, I promise you that this trainer will be for you. I wanna introduce you guys to my boys. I have my husband right here, Paolo. Sometimes we call him Turbo, but that's uh, his problem. And over here, I've got Tanner. We're gonna call him T-Pain because he's gonna be going through a lot of pain throughout this workout. So no matter where you're at, if you're a beginner, you're gonna be following Tanner for the next 30 days. And throughout these 30 days, you're gonna create a relationship with this guy and you guys are gonna get through this together. If you're a little bit above that and you're in the intermediate stage, I want you to follow this handsome man right here. He is a freak. We're gonna get him doing the intermediate. If you're intermediate, I want you to join him. I'm gonna allow you to have a relationship with my husband for the next 30 days and I'm cool with that shit. And then, there's me. I'm a weirdo. I like to move fast. I like to lift heavy. In fact, my weights are the same as these guys right here. No matter where you're at in your fitness game, if you feel like you're at the top, I challenge you to try and stay up with me. I promise you that this workout and this program over the next 30 days will allow you to find your mojo again and take you to places that you've never been. It's gonna challenge you. You're gonna do things that you've never done before. You're gonna do shit that you hate. But purpose behind this is not necessarily always doing things that you like to do. If you wanna make a change, you have to go through the hardships and what it takes to get there. So. Today's workout, Monster Monday, arguably the hardest workout of your week. I like to start the week the right way, set the tone for the rest of the week, and one thing I always, always say, never miss a Monday. You miss a Monday, you're more likely to miss the rest of the week. Start off strong, I don't care what it looks like, it's just as long as you complete that, you're gonna wanna keep going for the rest of the week. So today's workout is a 30, 60, 90. It's a three to one work to rest ratio. For every three seconds of work, you get one second of rest. We have two sections. In today's workout, I want you to grab a pen and paper. You're gonna need a set of dumbbells. If you're advanced or intermediate, you're also gonna need a med ball. Tanner has his ab mat, his dumbbells. I've got my ab mat, my dumbbells, and my ball, and so does Paolo. But that piece of paper, since today is day one, I want you to test exactly where you are at in your fitness game right now. I don't care if you're disappointed in your scores or if you're proud of them. Whatever is on that sheet of paper today, you are gonna put 30 days of hard work in with nutrition, with supplements, and with the correct training program to get you to a 30-day finish point. On that day, we're gonna retest this exact workout. So, we hit three rounds of each section. We've got A and B. On that third round, I want you to write down the amount of reps that you get per section. It will make a little bit more sense as we go, and I will remind you. I'm gonna be doing it with you, so I'm gonna let you know when you need to write it down and what you need to write down. Just make sure you have a pen and paper handy. So let's start with our warm up. Guys, let's bring our feet in between hip and shoulder width apart. We're gonna start with 20 air squats as I talk about the rest of the workout. Let's go. Booty back and down. Imaginary seat behind you. Tap your ass in it and drive up through the heels. So the first exercise we're gonna do is gonna be gorilla burpees. It is a lunge, a lunge, a squat with one burpee. We're gonna count as many reps as we can on that third round and we're gonna write it down. Then you have a 10 second rest. Then we're gonna move into 60 seconds of a combination of things. We're gonna split it. 30 seconds of one exercise with a 30 second hold. Then our 90 second, and relax. Let's start with some trunk twisters. Hands together, turn that body, touch them back in the middle. For that 90 seconds, we're gonna climb a ladder. You have two exercises. In section A, they just so happen to be upper body bodybuilding exercises. You're gonna hit one rep of each, followed by two reps of each, followed by three, and you're gonna see how high you can climb the ladder in 90 seconds. We'll take a score of that and we'll retest it in 30 days. Nice work. Let's head to some high knees. Bring those knees up, get that heart rate up, get that blood pumping. Good. So today's day one, you made it here, you made the decision to do this trainer. Now I need you to find a reason and dig deep to commit to yourself for the next 30 days. Butt kicks. I know that my reason is constantly changing. There's one that is so deep that will never go. 
and you don't ever need to tell anyone about it as long as you know. And then there's that one, that those other reasons that come and go. They're short-lived, but they keep me in the game. Whether it's a short-term goal, a long-term goal, you've got to have both to stay in this. How are you guys doing? Ready to go, come on. All right, let's start in the base of our squat real quick. Bring your elbows onto the inside of your knees. Drop your hips, butt down low, chest up high. Breathe. Good. Shift that weight over to that left foot. Again, butt down low, chest up high. I'm pumped. How are you guys doing? How are you feeling? I'm ready to go. These guys are so quiet, it's weird. Wake up! <laughs> All right, hands on the floor, raise your hips. Take a deep breath in and come up slowly. So like I told you before, first exercise, gorilla burpees. We've got a lunge, a lunge, a squat with one burpee. That counts as one rep. First round, I'm gonna walk around and show you guys what's going on. Second round, I'm gonna get involved. And third round, we're gonna finish together. You guys ready? Yes. Oh, yeah. Let's start with our 30 seconds of gorilla burpees in about 10 seconds. Here we go. Lunge, squat, burpee in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. So check this out. If you're beginning, we've got Tanner over here. Same exact movement. However, he's eliminating the plyo and he's not bringing his chest to the ground. We've got a walking lunge. Another walking lunge. We've got an air squat. Hands on the floor. Tap your feet. Land on flat feet. Stand up. Great job. Over here, we've got this sexy hunk. He's hitting out his plyometric gorilla burpees. Jumping lunge. Jumping lunge. Jumping air squat. Chest to the ground. Push up. Land on front feet. Jumping flat. Three, two, one, and rest. So up next, we've got this weird movement. I told you I was gonna keep you on your toes and make sure you never get bored. 30 seconds plus 30 seconds, starting with sprawl frog kick. Tap your feet, bring your feet to the outside of your elbows, land where you began, make sure your feet land on flat feet right here and stand up. Let me break it down for you. Tanner over here, we're going one leg at a time, making sure that we understand the movement. Other side. Now, if that's easy for you, I want you to hit both legs right here. Good, land on flat feet, standing straight up. Good, pal over here, hitting those double legs at the same time. Now, switch. You guys are gonna go into your bear crawl hold. So we're going to a tabletop position. We've got our wrists, elbows, and shoulders stacked directly on top of each other. We've got a tabletop in the back. We've got our hips directly underneath your knees. And I've only got a couple inches from his knees from the floor. Shins are parallel, core is tight. This poor guy over here is going through it right now. Same exact thing, get those knees down, same position. However, he has his ball in front of him, dropping his head, his core and his lats are on fire. Rest, great job, holy moly. Now I need you to grab your dumbbells. One set of dumbbells, you are not gonna put those down for the next 90 seconds. We've got two movements. We have bicep curls and high pulls, so check it out. And I also want you to take note that I'm lifting the same as the boys. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Here we go. We've got one bicep curl. Turn them over. One high pull. We're gonna climb the ladder. Turn them back over. Two bicep curls. Let's go. Turn them over. Two high pulls. You know what's next. Three plus three. Three bicep curls. It's one. That is two. That is three. Turn them over and high pulls. Keep going, boys. I wanna point out some key things. When we're going for our bicep curls, palms are flashing up. We're looking for that full extension of those arms, all the way up and all the way down. Good. Now, whenever we go into our high pulls, our palms are facing ourselves. Elbows are coming up to the sky. Now, how do we scale this? You will just decrease your weight. So, maybe start lighter. Your goal is to not let go. I want you to hold a weight that will challenge you, but not crush you. I want you to get through this day one feeling confident, not feeling like you can't, okay? So, let's go. Oh, looking good. We've got 30 seconds. Remember, elbows up to the sky, not behind you. We've got 25, where are we at, boys? Six, seven. Six, we're at seven over here. Nice, beautiful. It is your goal, to, it's you versus you. How high can you go? Can you get another rep in? I believe you can. You've got 12 seconds, let's go. Come on. Whatever you gotta do, get angry. This is you building your strength right here. We're growing. You've got three, you've got two, and rest. Great job, you've got 30 seconds rest. How was it? Oh, How amazing. was it? Amazing. They're very quiet. How was it, Tanner? Rough. Rough, I like that shit. Yeah, two more rounds. I wanna hear like the 
facts and the screams and you can say whatever you want. Emotion is so powerful. Get mad at me. Laugh at me. I don't care. Just oh, channel really it into you. your workout. Who Get mad at you. Who mad at you? Get mad. But did you die? But did you die? But did you die? No, you've got five seconds. Let's go again. Gorilla burpees. Lunge, lunge, squat, burpee. In three, two, one. Let's go. Lunge, lunge, squat, together, burpee. On your burpees, make sure that you are landing on flat feet. I want you to be in this for the long run. If we do our ballerina burpees, which look like this, Your knees are gonna hate you in like three months from now. Do it right, I want you here for the long run. Here we go, five seconds. Burpee, lunge, lunge, squat, together and rest. Great job, so you know what's next. We got our sprawl frog kicks. Hands on the floor, we can either go single leg or both leg, but the same thing is key. Feet start and finish in the same place, let's go. In, out, land, up. Hands on the floor, feet back, keep your hips up. In, out, land, stand up. Once you've got it down, pick up that pace and challenge yourself. Yes, use those legs to stand up rather than your back. Keep that back nice and tight. All right, boys, three seconds to our back or hold. Three, two, one, hold. This is so deceiving. This is so deceiving. Try and hold this for 30 seconds. And then add sprawl frog kicks before that. Keeping that core engaged, our lats, our core, our quads are on fire. Spread those fingertips, dig those fingers into the ground. Add some external rotation in those shoulders to really engage those lats. Let's go, Paolo. Bring those knees down, baby. We've got five, come on. Let's go, four, push it. Three, two, rest. All right, we got it again. So how high did you guys climb? Where'd you get, seven? Finish seven. Finish sevens. You're doing that shit again. If you've done it once, you can do it again. That voice that is doubting you, tell it to shut the fuck up. Let's go, grab those weights. Bicep curls in three, two, one, go. One curl, control it, flip them over. One high pull. What I don't want is your body jolting so you get these weights up. Strict movements. Use your core, focusing on only the upper body. Try and keep the rest of your body as still as possible. That's two. Where are we at? Three. Turn them over. High pull. Now with our high pulls, keep those shoulders down low. Chest up high. Don't let your weights pull you forward. Push that chest out. We've got four right here. Two, come on. Three. Let's go. Four, turn them around. High pull. One, come on. Two, yep. Three. Four, we're halfway, that's it, let's go again. One, two, let's go. Three, four, and five. Flip them over, up, one, two, three, four, and five. We're not stopping now, flip them over. One, let's go. Come on. Two, fight it, I'm fighting it too. Three, push past that feeling, four, Close those eyes. Five, we've got one more. Six, turn them over. Let's get these reps, we've got 10 seconds. One, two, let's go. Three, four, let's go boys. Five, and you, and six. We got through, I only got to sixes. You're impressive again to seven. Great job. So now I need you to grab that pen and paper. This is your last round. We're gonna do this together. I will let you know what counts as one rep. Have your pen and paper ready, so in your rest, you can write your total down. We're gonna start with our gorilla burpees. A lunge, a lunge, a squat and a burpee is one rep. I want you to empty that tank. It's me and you and these boys, and we're gonna get through this. Leave everything you have on the floor, right here, right now. Let's go, lunge, lunge, squat, let's go. Burpee, that's one. Lunge, lunge, squat, together, burpee. That's two. Lunge, lunge, squat, together, burpee. That's three. Lunge, lunge, squat, together, burpee. Four, one, two, three, in, down, up, five. Come on, last one, and rest. What five. you get? Five. What you get? Five. five, baby, write it down. 
Get ready. We're going again. Throw frog kicks. Count these right here. Go. In, out. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Let's go. Six. Seven. You got it. Eight. Nine. All the way up. Ten. Last one. Eleven. Rest. All right, not really. Write that number down. Get right into your suspended back roll or from the ground. Let's go. Drop those knees first. Find your position. Hold it and hold. Knees down. Breathe. We got it. Hold it nice and tight. Believe. You got this shit. Don't you dare drop. I'm watching you. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Holy shit. You have 20 seconds. You don't need to write anything down right there. So we count how high we can go. I know I've gotten to six and I need you to do that again. Just sprawls. That's all you're counting. Take a deep breath in. Take some water. And let's go. Here we go. Last round, we're fatigued. One bicep curl. Flip it. One high pull. Flip it. Two curls. Come on. Flip it. Two high pulls. Breathe. Stay in control. Three, two, three. Holy crap. Turn it over. One. Let's go. Two. Come on. Three. Curl. We've got one minute with 30 seconds in. Two, three, four. Flip them over. Shit. One, two, three, four. Flip them over. Up. Two, fight it. Three, how bad do you want it? Four, five, flip them over. We're doing it, come on, one, two, get angry. Whatever you gotta do, get happy. Four, five, flip them over, we're doing it, come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, come on, up. One, two, three, four, beat it. Five, you've got eight seconds, six. As many reps as possible, one, ah, two. Rest, holy moly. Whoa, I got six plus two. What did you get? Write that shit down. Oh my, okay. That is like gold. You're gonna hold on to that piece of paper for the next 30 days. Hoard that shit. Put it on your mirror in the morning. Make sure you see that every single day, that you made that commitment to start this program. And you absolutely are not gonna quit. You're gonna make it through the next 30 days, whether you like it or not. Traveling thigh killers. We've got another section. A is done. Just B. Same layout, 30, 60, 90, different exercises. 30 seconds of traveling thigh killers. If you're beginning, we're gonna keep our feet directly underneath our hips. You're gonna start like you're in a really small house. Head is underneath the ceiling. You're gonna bounce your ass up and down. So take two mini jumps out to your regular squat position. Two mini jumps in. What you're not gonna do is allow your knees to come onto the inside of your feet. Keep your knees on the outside. If you usually squat like this, this should be how your squats look. Tana's gonna do it in one place. Paolo and I are gonna do traveling thigh killers. We're jumping out, out as we go forward, in, in as we go back, traveling as we go. 60 seconds of spider monkeys. Push up plank position. Right foot on the outside of your right hand. You're gonna pounce your hips up and down, almost like a lunge for 30 seconds. Then you're gonna hold a wide push up plank hold. That's all you need to know right now. You need nothing other than your mat. So let's get our weights out of the way. Take a deep breath in, because we gonna do this shit. Boys, are you ready? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They're very quiet. Are you ready? Oh yeah, we're ready. Wake yeah. up. Can't think Come on, let's get to work, let's Wake go. Wake up, wake up. Let's get to work, come on. Quit dicking around, let's go. 10 seconds. Take a deep breath in. 
Straddling thigh killers. Keep the weight on the heels and the chest up. In five, here we go. Four, three, two, one. Out, out, in, in. Micro little jumps. Bouncing your ass up and down. Keep going. Good, weight is on the heels. Hips are hinged back. We're squatting up and down. Good, we're halfway. Facts about this. These guys are gonna tap out way sooner than all the ladies doing this. Our pain threshold is way more impressive. It really is. We've got five seconds. Paolo always taps out. Don't tap out, bro. Uh -uh. Three, not today. two, Come on. one. Not today. Ooh. All right, you've got 10 seconds. We're gonna go spider monkeys. Hands right underneath those shoulders. Front foot forward in three, two, one. Let's hit it. Pouncing off that front foot, bouncing up and down. Keep going. Tanner's over here. He's stepping it out. You want to step it out? You step it out. Maybe you do two steps and then you do two jumps. Hit it. One, two, back down. All right, we're just going to get there slowly. Good. We've got 10 more seconds. Paolo's using those hips. Those quads right now and those hip flexes are on fire. I know they are. Wide push up plank hold. Hands wider than your shoulders. Get ready, boys. Fingertips to either side of the room. You're going to hold this plank and your goal is to get your shoulders beyond your wrist. Hold it, breathe. We've got options. We can always go from our knees if we need to. We drop to our knees. This is gonna take some of the weight off of the shoulders so that we can get here. Or know this, the wider your hands, the harder it is. The closer your hands, the easier it is. You choose. Paolo's over here, fucking killing it. Three, come on. Two, one, rest. So similar to round one, you know how we climb that ladder with the bicep curls and the high pulls? We're gonna do the same thing, but with V-ups and push-ups. One V-up. You're gonna bring your hands up to meet your feet. Beginners, knees to chest. Let's go. In three, two, one. One V-up, good. Roll over, one push-up. Roll back over, two V-ups, one, two. Roll over, two push-ups, one, two. Good. For all my ladies, Push-ups are really challenging for us. It took me years to be able to get push-ups. We need to go from our knees, same thing goes. Keep those elbows tucked in, touch that chest on the floor, and push right back up. Stick your ass up in the air too. If you're in between, it's always great to feel your own body weight. Go down from your feet, drop to your knees, and push back up. Come back, down from your feet, drop to your knees, and push back up. Boys, where are we at? Four. Four! Let's go, Tana. Tana obviously has a solid push-up game. He doesn't ever look like he missed chest day. He's looking pretty jacked. Nice. So our knees to chest, knees to chest, bring it back out. Knees to chest, bring it back out. We're gonna build that core strength to finally get here one day, okay? And folding that body. And it's really important that you bring your hands up to your feet and not your feet to your hands. Push-up game is on point. We've got 25 seconds. Let me join in with you guys. Where are we at? Finish five. Finish five. Let's go for six. If you want an extra challenge, keep those heels off the floor for the six reps. Keeping your core engaged throughout. That's four, five, and six. Good. I'm a little fresher than them. We've got less than ten. Let's go. We've got one, two, three, four, five, and six. Relax. Great job. That's round one done. Give me one of these. You guys are on fire. Okay. Yeah! Let's get to work. Get to work. Go. Round two, baby. Oh. That first one was like that awkward first date when you don't really know each other. Shit's about to get real. We're gonna go to second base on this one. Yeah. Traveling thigh killers in 10 seconds, people. You want some active recovery? Show me your best moves. Five seconds in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Out, out, in, in. Breathe. Bounce your booty up and down. Keep the weight in the heels from your hips to your regular squat. 20 seconds, we're 10 seconds in. Stay focused. You can use your arms. If you want a challenge, bring your hands behind your head and do not use your arms. 10 seconds. Breathe. Nine, let's go. We've got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Spider monkeys with a wide push up plank hold. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Let's hit it. Pouncing from side to side. Breathe. Good. If your mobility is not great, Tana, do me a favor. Put your hands on top of this ball. 
Now remember, it's an unstable environment and do the same thing. This is gonna bring your chest up. You don't have to have so much mobility in the hips to complete the same movement. So if you need it, you come right here. Paolo, let's go. 10 seconds, punch. Come on, all the way. We've got five, four, three, two, one. Rest, kind of, not really. Push up plank position, let's hold it. Breathe and hold. Challenge yourself if you want. Rock your weight forward onto your toes. Use those fingertips. Breathe. If you need to bring them in, bring them in. Hold it. Let that sweat just drip off your face. That puddle in front of you is hard work. Let's go. It's monster motherfucking Mondays. It was never supposed to be easy. Let's go. Hold it. We've got three. We've got two. One. Oh my God. So good. B ups and push ups. Two of my favorite things. Easy, easy. Two of my favorite things. You've got 10 seconds. Chill on the floor. Get that rest in. Ah. Five seconds, guys. Get ready. Three, two, one. V up. Hit it. Roll it over. One push up. Good. Roll it back over. Two V ups. One, two. Roll it over. Let's go, Paolo. One, two. Roll it back over. One, two, three. And again, stick with me, let's go. One, two, three. Good, I like a tricep push up myself. Keep those elbows in. Two, three, four, hell yeah. One minute, come on. One, two, three, four. Back over, let's go. One, two, three, Four, five, killing it. 45 seconds, we are halfway. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. And again, Paolo. One, keep up, let's go. Two, three, four, five, six. Almost missed that one. 20 seconds, let's go. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six. It is you versus you. You like to play games? Me too. Beat your highest score. One, 10 seconds. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. And rest. Fuck. I got six rounds plus seven V ups. But don't write that one down yet. You've got one more round till you write your scores down. This is it. Get up. Get up. Shake it off. Get your, keep your head in the game. Don't check out yet. Three minutes of work with some change in between. And this shit is over. Get ready. Thigh killers, we're gonna count. Out, out, and in is one rep. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's hit it. Out, out, in, in. One, two, three, let's go. Four, yep, five, I know it burns. Those quads, six, let's go boys. 10 seconds, let's go, seven. Out, out, in, in, eight. I can get one more, I know I can, so can you. Nine, good shit. Write that down, nine total thigh killers, or however many you got. Spider monkey, I want you to count your reps, here we go. Hit it. One, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna stop counting so I don't annoy you, but keep going. Breathe. Good. One. Yep. Seven, 28, 29, 30. Keep going. I believe in you. One, two, you got five seconds. I got 40. Hold that plank. Write down that score. Hold that plank. Let's go. Breathe, this is your finisher. To finish with this, after that shoulder burn, is really testing you. I know you got it in you. I know you got it in you. This is all mental. You made it here. You can make it 10 more seconds. I dare you to shove that weight even further forward. This is it. Come on. Five, four, let's go. Three, two, one. Shake it off. I know those arms are tired, but don't worry, we're gonna start with V-ups. Get a towel if you need it. 
I'm sweating like a motherfucker. Oh yeah. Ten seconds. Buckets. Buckets. I'm sweating buckets. Five seconds, people. V ups to begin. Three, two, one. This is it. One. Come on. One. Let's go. One, two. Power. Keep those heels off the floor. Come on. One, two. I know you got it in you. I believe in you. Two, three. You gotta believe in yourself. Don't sell yourself short. One, two, three. Yeah. Four, one, two, three, four. Let's go. You've got one minute for push ups. One, two, three, four. Push it. You can do this. Set your own pace and stick to it. Let's go. Oh, five. I believe it. Let's go. We're halfway. Do it. Four. Five. Where are you at, boys? You're very quiet. Five. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Yes. And again. Those V-ups, your quads are on fire. One, two, three, four, five, six. I've got 15 seconds, what you got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm getting one push up, it kills me. Three, two, one. Out of work. Way to work! Write down what you got. I got six plus one. I know you may, whoa, I'm sweating. I know you may have done better in the second round, but that's not what we're testing. We're testing you when you're in your last round, when you've given everything you've got. Learn to not hold anything back. People always say to me like, this day is so much harder. No way, the day is as hard as you want it to be. You're in control of that intensity and that's what I mean by that. Don't work out for hours a day, dicking around, giving you 20%. Work out for 30 minutes a day and give it 150% and leave your body on the floor. Every workout I do, including this one, I feel like I'm like done, like there's nothing left to give. And that's how I know I've had a good workout. If I can stand back up and walk out of the gym like nothing happened, barely breaking a sweat, that's lame. Get back in that gym and do better, because I know you can. Your only one is holding you back is you. You guys crushed it. Welcome to the program. Welcome to Monster Monday. These guys destroyed it too. Paolo, Tana, we got Turbo and T-Pain. I don't know what my nickname is yet. We'll think about it. Thank you guys for joining us and we'll see you soon. Good shit. Oh my goodness. Happy Monday.